Well, this weekend, thousands of women's basketball fans were expected to flock to Fort Wayne for the NCAA tournament. The Coliseum was scheduled to host regional and semi-regional final games before the tournament was ultimately canceled due to the coronavirus. Peter Hood has more on how that cancellation is impacting both event organizers and fans alike. Doug Weaver had been looking forward to this weekend for a while. Super excited to go. Um, bought eight tickets right off the bat. We actually had second row right behind the bench side. Great tickets for what would have been great women's basketball games, featuring some of the best college teams in the country. Not even talking about the first and second rounds. This is a, the winner would have went to the final four. Um, would have been huge for the city as well, and obviously for all of Northeast Indiana. Um, we we go to a lot of things at the Coliseum. It'd be great to for the Coliseum to kind of show itself off as well on really the national stage. Instead, as the coronavirus pandemic looms, the doors to the Coliseum are closed, the parking lot empty, and basketball fans like Weaver are sitting at home. It's the right decision, but you know, it's, just, it's still disappointing uh, overall. The Coliseum had already sold over 2,500 tickets for the games this weekend. They were expecting to sell several thousand more. And event organizers like Ashley Malone have seen hundreds of hours of hard work go down the drain. A knee-jerk reaction is, of course, to be disappointed, right? We had all worked so long and so hard, and we were so confident that we were going to do a great, a great job and produce an amazing tournament. Although there is disappointment, that confidence is still there. In Purdue Fort Wayne Athletic Athletic Director Kelly Hartley Hutton is hopeful her staff will get another shot. In terms of future bids, we're, we're aggressive and we're working together. And it also the process demonstrated to us that Visit Fort Wayne, Purdue Fort Wayne, and the Coliseum, you know, we're really strong colleagues. So just very confident that there are going to be other opportunities in the very near future. In Fort Wayne, Peter Hood, Fox 55 Sports. And all of the fans we spoke to today via social media have already received refunds for the tickets they purchased.